Okay, guys, so you can't really see me because we're in the dark. Hey, what's up? I'm right here. Carlos is here, too. Hey, what's up? Uh, I wanted to show you guys. Look at this view, dude. We came here to watch the sunrise. And yes, I know there's a big-ass tree right in the middle. But we're thinking I maybe we'll go over there to see it better. But look at this view. The only bad thing is that this is beat up since our hurricane a long time ago and the floor is kind of um not stable and we are up high i mean we're not that high up but you know we're up and yes we are the only ones here what's up hi hello i don't know what day it is today uh we decided to do this because we've been going to sleep like at 10 o'clock in the morning and waking up at like six o'clock in the afternoon so what better way than to spend it watching the sun rise i mean like with no one around that's the best part it's coronavirus supposed to be in quarantine there's no one around so that's the best part don't have to use the mask we have them just in case we don't have to use them because there's absolutely no one around and plus this is kind of a deserted place anyway no one comes here anymore because it's so unstable do you want to be catapulted? <laughs> catapulted? Catapult. Catapulted. I want to be in a safe place. <laughs> He's kind of nervous. Because I weigh more than you. Every time I step on it. Um, That's what you hear. Step on it. Now it's not doing it as much. No, we got to get my finger. Yeah. Here's, it's safer. Look, babe. This one feels very stable. See? There you go. Uh, so we decided to move from there to here, but I think it's a worse decision. Yeah. So we're probably going to have to go back. I'm just exploring because out of every single time I've been here, I've never been to this section. Never. Let's go back. We have got an update. Look at this view right there. Look at it. If you want to see more photos, you can go check them out. They are probably going to be in my Just Yes It. I think my Just Yes It channel. Instagram. I said channel. <laughs> my Just Yes It Instagram. More photos of these beauties from like over there. Amazing. There was great parts over here as well. Now it changed, but look at that look at that thumbnail look at that <laughs> see his 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 those photos are amazing look at that look at that contrast look at that that yellow that purple that pink that green on the bottom look at that okay stop rubbing it in my face we got que son eso de plátano verdad yeah we got Palos de plátano. If you don't know what that is, it's a plantain tree. <laughs> There's all of this right here. All of that plantain trees right there. And that's a drop, just in case. In case you can't see it in the camera, that does that. that. <laughs> but that's wow. That's a wow view right there. Look at it. Look at that. Wow. What's up you guys? Today is quarantine day. I don't even give a fuck anymore. Because we're in the 100 and something, something, something. I'm going to show you some products that I just got from Amazon. Okay guys, so this is the first product that I'm going to show you. And by the way, these three products, they are not sponsored at all. I just wanted to show you guys the new equipment that i will be using when once i start my exploring videos again in like abandoned places and stuff i am still in quarantine so they might come in a few weeks they might not it all the pens anyway this is the first one it's called through night and it is a flashlight a very highly rated flashlight from amazon i mean it's sold on amazon 
so it looks like this it does not come with the strap on it i put it on it separately so there you can see the strap it has these two it has this thing where you could like obviously make the hand strap bigger or smaller so it just doesn't flip off so here's the flashlight through night tn12 v4 this is the button for all of the settings and this is the power button so in a minute i'm gonna show you how it works and the settings and how strong it looks underneath it brings a case just a regular old velcro it also brings an extra cover for the top button to turn it on a ring and i honestly don't know what that is but i'm guessing something in that section too <laughs> this brings a belt clip just looks like that just simple just slip it right into your pants Okay, so it's completely dark right now. This is the flashlight, and I'm going to show you how bright it just brightens everything. Supposedly, this goes a long, long range, range but I'm not going to try that out right now because I don't want to go outside. So, let's do it here. Here's on. That's the first setting. Then you just click once. Second setting. Third setting fourth setting a fifth setting that is bright and then quick disclaimer right now there's going to be strobes so if you are sensitive to that kind of light uh click off or close your eyes for like five seconds i'll let you know when i uncover them so in three two one cover your eyes and that happens in one, two, three. You can uncover them right now. So basically, basically, basically. <laughs> so basically, that happens with this, like in the button. Instead of just like clicking once, you're gonna hold it down. Don't worry, I'm not gonna do it right now. But you just hold it down, press off, and it'll start strobing. To take it off, you do not have to leave it pressed down. You just click once again, and it will go to whatever setting you had the light on already. So it won't go all the way to the beginning. It will, like if you have it on this setting, it'll go back to this setting. It's a pretty cool flashlight. I really love it. Like right here, it's just brightening up my whole room. Look at that. Oh, hey, look. Oh. This is the second product and this is basically a charger for the batteries of the flashlight i have two but one's obviously inside the flashlight because of the preview so basically it's this big they're very fat and big and this is the recommended imp for that specific flashlight so that's why i specifically bought these and the flashlight does not bring batteries this is you have to buy separately there are a lot of other versions other companies this is just the one that i bought hopefully it works uh that's how the box is victogen and n2 plus it brings the cable and that's it so here is kind of cool because you could slip this in and it tells you how much it is without having to have it plugged in and it's powered by this button. So there's telling you and this battery only has 25% so I need to charge it. This is the cord that came just with your standard micro, what's it called babe? I don't know what that's called. And USB on the other side. Okay, so this here is actually very, very highly recommended in the urban exploring community 
a lot of people have it a lot of people have done reviews i know i am late for the train because this is old but i decided to splurge and get one so it's the newer light thing that you put onto the camera light thing So this is the first time me opening it. I have no idea how this looks. Okay, so this is the cable and this is the charging mount. It has two spaces. It out. Okay, so I took everything out of their little plastic bag. So here you can see it's exactly the same as the other mount. It's just one of those micro chargers. Then this is the mount itself. This is actually not heavy. The other one, the mount itself is actually heavy. This one isn't. Dual charger. These are the two batteries and they are pretty heavy. And as you can see, pretty large as well. So that's everything. So it brings two, which is very, very nice. Okay, now this is the actual light. So I got it specifically because it has that many LED bulbs. It's like a lot. <laughs> it should be really good. Seen it in videos. It looks pretty good on camera at least. And that's just what I need on camera. Okay, so once again, I took everything out of the plastic. So it brings the mount, which is actually pretty high which is what I need because in my camera, I can't put it on the top of the camera. It needs to go on the sliding thing that I have to the side, but I need the mount to be taller than the actual camera just so this could fit. Cause if not, this is not gonna fit, which later on, I'll see if it works. So basically, this is the back of it. That's where the battery goes. And then these are the, oops. These are the dials, if I remember correctly, it's how bright you put it, I think. I don't know, can't remember. And so without any of these things, which these are filters, this is an amber filter and this is just a plain white filter, you could actually feel all of the bulbs. So they are, uh, a word I can't I can't remember how to speak English so you put this here oh the bulbs are out in the open that's that's what I was looking for so basically you put on the filter and then yeah I'm gonna have to try this out later on probably probably later or tomorrow I'll do it but yeah, this looks more orange than amber, especially on camera. It looks very orange on camera. It looks like a Cheeto orange, but supposedly it's amber. So yeah, those are everything. I hope you liked that review. Not really much of a review, but I just wanted to show you guys what I got for exploring. And I am so excited. So subscribe. Hit like, comment, do everything, especially subscribe because there's a lot of things coming in the future. Uh, I'm already planning on doing some exploring trips. I got a few places in mind here in Puerto Rico. And also, we have a trip in October. Might or might not be happening because of this whole COVID thing, but it's probably going to happen. So subscribe. And find out if it happens or not. If it happens, if it's going to be off the hook. Right, babe? Yeah. It's going to be amazing. So, see you then.